Hey guys, got an unboxing for you today. This is from Faro Concepts. This is their PVS31 battery retention system. Um, been wanting one of these for a while and I missed it when they first released them, so I've been patiently waiting for them to come back in stock. And here we have one in multicam. And uh, we'll go ahead and open it up and then I'll grab my helmet and we'll get it installed on there and kind of show you the various options and stuff that this product provides. Let's see here. here we have the item, Ferro Concepts PVS31 battery retention system in multicam. Comes in a small baggie with all of the parts. Go ahead and open this up for you. So this is the main piece, has this rigid kind of fiber material. Um, so this would hold the PVS31 pack. And then these various holes and grommets are for the shock cord. And I believe there's also some retention cable in here for your strobe that you can attach it to. And various um, fasteners and hardware to secure um, whatever setup you're running on your helmet. And uh, mainly attaches to Velcro uh, using existing Velcro and then has these two adapters that actually screw into the rear rails of the helmet underneath or on top of the arc rails but you would screw the existing screw through this and into the um, other side of your H nape or Oc dial. Um, and then this piece, I think you can adjust the height of depending on how high up you want your strobe to sit. And that's what this is designed for. So you've got some multicam loop Velcro here for the strobe. Um, looks like it's cut out mainly for like a Manta strobe or a Hellstar 6 strobe. Um, looks about the size for either of those. And then I th you would line the holes up to where you would want it to sit and then you would run the shock cord through that to uh, kind of assemble it into one piece. So. That is what I will do right now. I'm going to set this up to how I would want it on my helmet. And then I'll cut back into this video and kind of show it off. So stay tuned. All right, so here we have the Ferro Concepts PVS31 battery retention system installed on my uh, TMC SF Carbon helmet. And kind of go over how it fits, kind of get a general idea of how it's put together. I pretty much followed the instructions that are on the uh, product page on Ferro Concepts website to uh, put it together. But you pretty much just kind of meld the two pieces, the bridge for the strobe and then the main PVS31 kind of plate together with the shock cord and you route it through various points. And then here you can see these little pieces that screw in under the helmet rails or um, the helmet screws. I think you could still use these with um, helmets that you don't have rails installed onto. It just kind of sits underneath the screw and kind of keeps everything in place and secure. And with the shock cord, you can also like retain items underneath. So here we have a blast gauge. Um, this is Velcroed to that Velcro here, but uh, for added retention, I put the shock cord over it which I think is pretty neat. And then also lets you route your cable for the battery pack. You can kind of route it underneath the shock cord and I kind of have it wedged underneath the like plate itself and then kind of route it through here and then around my strobe. And then I'm also using this uh, Project Monarch patch to kind of force route it through the Velcro channel here um, with my Velcro layout, which I think works pretty well. Keeps everything nice and tidy looking. 
and then I kind of have the cord secured up at the front. And again, this is a dummy cord, so I don't really have anything to plug into, but this uh, replica battery pack did include a cord. So I thought I would demonstrate kind of like a routing method you could use with the Ferro Concepts battery retention system and then routing whichever battery cable you may have for your setup on your helmet. So just an example, um, all my stuff is dummy replica, so I don't have real nods or anything like that. But hopefully this gives you guys an idea of what this system might look like and if it'll work for you and if you would be interested in such a setup. So, yep, uh, pretty, pretty cool uh, design. I think it looks really neat as a little bit of versatility to your helmet um, rather than just sticking your battery pack on the back via velcro you kind of have a more secure mounting method as well as tying in um, kind of retention for your strobe as well so this is just how I have mine set up and I am pretty happy with it so yep there you have it the Ferro Concepts PBS 31 battery retention system thanks for watching Alright guys, one last thing, um, the hardware that is included with the kit, I thought all of these were broken because they're not like spring-loaded or anything, and uh, that's by design, um, you actually have to like break a piece inside for the spring to actually activate, so what you do is you just push it in until you hear a click, like that, and then it'll activate the spring on the inside so that's one thing I was like kind of worried about when I first uh, was installing the kit was that these um, weren't really activating properly and that's because I didn't know that you needed to uh, push down really hard to uh, break something on the inside before the spring would activate so if you run into that issue I hope this helps you